Ukraine's military spokesman has reported that Russian-backed militants are deploying large numbers of tanks and other heavy weapons in the direction of Mariupol, the Ukrainian Azov Sea port city, which is seen by many as the next logical target for Putin's proxy forces in east Ukraine. The hidden movement of military equipment and human resources of the enemy towards the confrontation line continues, mainly in the direction of Mariupol. Militants were due to begin withdrawing heavy weapons from the line of contact today as part of the Minsk peace plan signed earlier in February. Lysenko claimed that this withdrawal had so far not taken place and therefore Ukraine could not withdraw its weapons. While attacks on positions of Ukrainian servicemen and shelling of peaceful areas and residential areas continue, there can be no withdrawal of heavy weaponry. The area of Mariupol is not the only part of eastern Ukraine where there are reports of ceasefire violations. Seen here, buses filled with Ukrainian troops had to withdraw from the town of Dobaltseva after taking days of heavy fire from Russian-backed militants despite the Minsk ceasefire. Dobaltseva links the militant strongholds of Donetsk and Luhansk, and militants claim the ceasefire did not apply to them in Dobaltseva.